Soldiers on stilts. That's the army's name for the men who garrison the sea forts in the Thames estuary. Approachable only by boat, it's the loneliest job in the army. During the war, the sea forts were a top secret. Now, Pathy Victorial can take you for a look at life there today. Every fortnight, a new garrison takes over the peacetime task of cleaning and maintaining guns, searchlights and radar sets. Two weeks on shore, two weeks high and dry above water level. As far as possible, they're always kept together as a team. During the war, from 1943 onwards, the Sea Fort's 3.7 guns kept watch for bombers and marauding e-boats. Now, gun drill helps to relieve the monotony of life on stilts. On the searchlight tower, lights that never see an unfriendly aircraft still have to be kept in trim. There are seven towers to each fort connected by steel bridges, each fort 750 tons of reinforced concrete. This is a riding light carried by each fort which burns all the night through. Today, the ports are in touch with lifeboat stations on shore, ready to help shipping in distress. Once the guardians of London, now the sentinels of the ships that pass. Home for a soldier. 